Hey everyone and welcome to the Uke Stuff channel. Today I have an unboxing for you of a Hurricane ukulele. Again, this one comes from Amazon and I just want to tell you that one of the things that you should do is if you like ukuleles or like a particular brand of ukulele, you should follow their social media accounts, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and keep track of what they're doing because occasionally they will offer a discount to buyers of their products. Another extremely long Amazon box. We'll cut the top and bottom. There we go. Lots of paper and an ukulele box. All right, uh, again, Hurricane does a nice job with their boxes. They're not messing around with this. It's a nice, thick, sturdy box that would be good to reship an instrument in. And right off the bat, another really good example of the Hurricane gig bag. That really nice material. Got a hanging handle, double backpack straps. Not super padded, but padded. A lightly padded handle. Doesn't have that extra webbing around it. And a small pocket on the front. We'll make sure that it works. It's always a good thing to do. Check in the inside of it. Here you go. So you've got your Hurricane logo embroidered on the side. All right, so there's our ukulele. Kind of a neat piece. They now include a little headstock cushion. I like that. And then here's your bag of stuff. So let me put the ukulele in my ukulele hanger right here, and we'll take a look at what's in the gig bag or the the bag of accessories here that Hurricane includes. So you get a little card with user services card, basically I think warranty, a thin ukulele strap, and I'm curious what kind of strap this is. Yeah, unfortunately it's a clip strap. I, I don't like that. You get a tuner. You get at least one pick. You get a cleaning cloth and some extra what look to be Aquila strings and of course the little fuzzy bag. Now let's take a look at the ukulele itself. Like many it comes in that sort of seraphim packaging rubber banded at the top. Traditional crown headstock if anything a little sharper than average with the uh, CME Hurricane logo on the top. This is a Sapele laminate, so it would be very similar to the ranch in a lot of ways. And it is very light etching around the sound hole. Very um, matte finish ukulele. So not very glossy. Fret ends are a touch sharp, especially down there. You can hear it. Action looks to be pretty good. We'll get a chance later when we actually do the full review. Um, it is a walnut fretboard and a walnut bridge, which is not surprising, following the CITES, I believe it's CITES, uh, hardwood restrictions, although those have been lifted. So uh, companies now, in music instrument companies, can use rosewood again. So let's tune it up, uh, kind of rubber uh, tuning pegs, like on the end, kind of rubbery. Uh, you can see that there's a white binding with purpling right next to it. And it is notch curving on the inside, but again, when we do the full Ute Guide review, we get a chance to see what that looks like on the inside. Do 
do it again. tune that's something that you'd expect with any ukulele there's where it's really out of tune that a tune a string is really stretching all right It's the Hurricane Concert Kit. They have a few of these on Amazon, different styles. Uh, this one is the Sapele model, I believe, again. It comes with a really nice case. It feels nice and sturdy. Um, again, a little different material than like the... Um, and there's a softer material that's used by like Aklot. So it's a little more... It feels a little more durable, like heavy duty. So I, I like that. That's a nice feel for the bag. Uh, it comes with a pretty nice kit. The only negative with the kit that I see is that it comes with this kind of strap. Uh, by the way, if you have never seen this kind of strap, what you do is you put it around your neck and then you can stretch it out if you need to make it longer or whatever. But then what it does is it goes around the ukulele and clips into the sound hole. Now, it works and Jake Shimabukuro uses kind of a strap like that. His is a little different, has more padding on it and so forth. But it works, but if you let your hands go on the ukulele, it falls off. Now the good side of this is that unlike many other instruments that include one of these, it does not come with strap buttons. So uh, they're not giving you a strap for something that already has strap buttons. So if you want strap buttons on this, that's something you're going to have to add or have added. But most of us eventually kind of learn how to add those ourselves. So we'll have a good time reviewing this in the future. So thank you for watching the video. I hope you're having a great day and I will be back soon with some more Yik stuff for you.